And we are with Terry Cronin, the creator of Students of the Unusual, and J. Chris Campbell. And uh, we're talking about the comic and what they're doing for student, students of the unusual here at MegaCon 2009. What have you got going on here at the booth? Well, one of the things that we've got going on is a very special commemorative MegaCon issue. Only here at MegaCon, what we did is we collected a story that ran through all the issues of students of the unusual called Stubborn. Chris has got it right here. The artist of Recalcitrant Jones, J. Chris Campbell, right here. Um, and this is beautifully illustrated by Julia Lichty. It's a that is gorgeous. It's gorgeous. It's a very surreal story, uh, very dreamlike. One of the most unusual stories in comics. I think people will enjoy it. And then you flip it over, and it's another comic book. These are the winners of the comic story contest that we had. And this is Stephen Shea and Luandra Whitehurst did a, a story about the Florida skunk ape, which was a, a character that fit into what we were doing. Could you repeat that again, the Florida skunk ape? You know about the Florida skunk ape? I must have missed that urban legend. All right, the Florida skunk ape is very similar to the Bigfoot legend of out west, but in, in Florida, it's it's a Bigfoot that smells terrible. They often talk, say it sounds... As opposed to the ones that are fragrant. Well, they say it smells like a skunk, and that's why they call it a skunk ape. <laughs> again, this is J. Chris Campbell. Let's show yeah. off the book that you've been working on here. Yeah, this is actually a collection of the uh, story that I did in Students of the Unusual, Recalcitrant Jones and the Deadbeats. And uh, it's about uh, uh, this rock and roll guy, and he created a band of dead musicians. Dead musicians? Yeah. The best kind? Yeah, Elvis Presley, Dennis Joplin, Jimi Hendrix, and uh, they actually come back as zombies. And so they're zombie musicians, so they're the dead beats. So Terry wrote the story, and I did all the illustrations for that. Because everybody loves zombies yes, nowadays. absolutely. And especially celebrity zombies. You can't go wrong. You know? Celebrity uh, celebrity zombies and musicians. Right, zombies. exactly. And they still perform well? Yeah. Because well, you'd think being dead would have a hard time, you know, affecting of, motor coordination. Right. Part of the story is they start to stink and, you know, there's problems with that. And then some of them lose limbs and different things like that. And so there, there's other, yeah, they... they there are issues <laughs> to deal with. <laughs> it gets dealt with in the book. It's a, it's a fun... It's a fun book and uh, had a great time doing all the illustrations for it. And Terry's a really good guy to work What's with. What's the title so. again, Chris? Recalcitrant Jones and the Deadbeats. Recalcitrant, wow, that's tough. Yeah, that's Recalcitrant a tough Jones yeah. and the Deadbeats. Yeah.